Hey guys, Ryan Coleman, Hometown Realty. So excited to be with you. Vlog 18 is officially started. I'm out here in one of our condos, brand new cellar we're about to put on the market. Waterfront living, luxury condos on the water. How awesome is that? Who we got in the back? Is that Neyland? Neyland Stadium, it's about that time in our area. Fall is about to hit football season. And East Tennessee is about to start Saturday. So excited for that. I got a sneak, actually, should I tell him or should I wait? I got a sneak peek for you. We might make a trip over to Neyland. I don't know. Stay with this vlog and we'll see if we can maybe take you over to Neyland, get you some behind the scenes. Let's go, D. We got some work to do. D, I think you might want to get in here with me, man. We got a, we got a partner grill, man. It's that time, and it's fall. Getting a little workout on. This luxury living, man, it's awesome. Got your own pool. Look at the lake. All the boats are about to start coming in next day or so. And Saturday, I'm gonna be a packed house versus BYU. These condos are great. Even keep a guy like me, woo, on my toes. So what I love about this area is luxury living, have his own clubhouse, own workout facility, no excuses in here. Got every equipment you can think of, got some dumbbells, workout, you can got a spot to work on your abs, and it's got it all. So it's, come on, let's walk through it real quick. Coming through here, what I like about this condo and all the amenities, it's got some great areas, perfect for that young professional. For well, that executives, a lot of our clients are downsizing and everything that's going on downtown, all the growth, all the development, really makes East Tennessee one of the best places that you can relocate. I was talking to my wife briefly on the phone and I was chatting with her. I said, what really makes East Tennessee so special? And I said, I don't think people understand the power of what we're gonna come up here in the next couple of days. It's, it's just football. Most people say, what's well, just football? You guys love your football, but it's more than that. It's something about the synergy of all East Tennessee and all the Vols fans get together. Even if you're not going to the game, it's just something about everybody rooting for that same team. And we're all pulling together. And when I was little, I came down here and watched my first ball game, little guy. And my uncle brought me, showed me the lights, showed me everything. As a young boy, I was like, oh, this is great. Never saw anything like that. And I think it was just something about the people it's the environment and the synergy. Hey, 30 some years later, look at me. I'm here selling real estate, excited, living the dream. But don't discount Knoxville. Don't discount the ball in the area. There's so much here to offer. Me and Daniel were talking prior. We're like, it's the second largest stadium in all the U.S. But we got the best fans, man. Isn't that awesome? So I, I want to get you through here real quickly. We're going to go upstairs. I'm going to show you this brand new condo. It's about to hit the market tomorrow. And we're going to go upstairs, quick peek, and then maybe I think we're going to go over to Neelan. We'll see. So stay with me. We're here in the rec room and before we go here we're about to go to another customer's house that we're just about to put on the market but i want to chat with you for a second and we talk about all that takes that goes into business what we're doing today and all the preparation it takes and it's kind of funny as we're across from neyland stadium balls are about to start their season here on saturday and all the work they put in spring and summer it's kind of like you guys what you put all this year as we started our whole year now related real estate and we're coming down to the last quarter it's fall in three weeks, it's gonna be fall time. Businesses for us actually starts picking up. It's the busiest time other than spring and summer, we tell everybody. But a lot of people will be the slowest time. 
but it's all about preparation that you put in in the beginning months that leads you to this opportunity. So I was chatting with an agent the other day and we were talking about preparation and why it's so important that if you don't put the preparation, kind of like pool, we get to the last shot, you don't have an opportunity to win. And so all those days of prospecting, right? Lead follow-up, working on your ads and perfecting all these different things that are required in the marketplace of a very successful or competitive dynamic market. How do you do all those things? Why do you do the same thing, that repetitious boredom, doing the same thing? Doesn't it get boring, guys? I know I, it happens to me whether we're making the calls, doing the same presentations, or just doing the monotonous video or different things that we're doing. Doesn't it get bored? It does. But that's like the guys of Saturday. And I know the players have that same, same thing where they're running the same plays, the same routes, the same coverages. And it's like, coach, we're doing it the same thing a hundred times. It's where preparation meets opportunity. Because if you're not prepared, you don't get the shot. You're not ready. If we get to the last shot and you haven't practiced over and over, you don't have that confidence. If you don't have that confidence, you won't take the shot. You may stutter. You may get on the phone with that million dollar client and not know what to say. You may lose the sale to the next guy. So preparation means everything. But you gotta be prepared. You gotta have that confidence. How about that confidence? Most people don't understand that if you, when you practice, you get better. It's like when you start working out. Well, you know, I was down there working out with some weights, but the more repetition that I do, the stronger that I get, the more you look at yourself in the mirror, you're like, oh man, I'm looking good. You know, the guys over there flexing on the gym. It's that confidence. It's that swagger, right? You gotta have that in business and you gotta also have that in life. And if you don't put the preparation in, you try to wing it, you just put a little bit of results, you get shaky. And when it's your opportunity for the shot, you may miss it. So my tip of the day is make sure you prepare, make sure you do your homework. When you show up on your appointment, when you show meet your customer, don't practice on your customer. It's show time. It's game time. We're going to hit the field, the balls. It's no practice. It's game on and you got to be ready. So that's my tip of the day. Hey, we're going to go look at another property. We're about to hit the market. We're going to try to take it to Neyland Stadium. I'm not going to say try. We're going to take it to Neyland Stadium, walk around the sky boxes, and we're going to close out this vlog. Another new listing about to go on the market here in South Knoxville. Some great clients that we just listed the property. We're doing our marketing, doing a little prep work. Gotta pick up some paperwork. Come on guys, come with me. All right guys, so we're over here in a brand new listing in South Knoxville. Just put on the market, actually later on today it's gonna hit. Do a little marketing, picking up some disclosures, some paperwork, always fun. Did, do you show them around, Daniel? Take a second, show them around this house. It's gonna hit the market very quickly. I don't expect it to be around on the weekend, but you want to take notice of it. Three bedroom with a possible four bedroom, 1,500 square feet, South Knoxville. You gotta see it. It was an ordinary day. Then she walked in and looked my way. With just a glance, yeah, I was sold My head in disarray How are you? How's your not been gone? I said, I'm not that type of guy you know But why don't we talk? Yeah, let me buy you a drink And then she kissed my face, yeah I'm falling I was all in Now I'm running, running to survive Hey guys, just got done shooting vlog 18, officially over. Just got done leaving Neyland Stadium. How exciting was that to go to the box seats, 
go through the tour of the stadium. They're getting all the lines ready. It's about that time in East Tennessee. You guys excited? I know we are, man. I hope you like this vlog. Hope you guys follow us. Make sure you like, subscribe, maybe share it with a friend. It means a lot. Guys, are you ready for some football in East Tennessee? We are. A couple days, we're about to start. Hey, I don't know what else to say, but I gotta get out of here and do some more work, but go balls.